Hi everyone. What I'm going to do today is hopefully quickly walk you through the process of getting WeVideo up and running. So in this point in the project, I've, I have my poem to work with, and now the task before me is to go to Google Images and select all the media I feel best represents the poem. In the process, I created a folder and I titled it I2014 Poem We Video Media Collection. And then I made sure to put all the images that I selected in that folder. I also made sure that while I was saving those images to the folder, that the image titles are obvious. I know what the image is and that it's in the JPEG format. Um, if it's not an obvious title or in the JPEG format, you can edit it to be exactly how you want it to be. So from there, I'm ready to create my Wii video. I'm gonna navigate over to the Create section of Drive and I will locate Wii Video, which is already a connected app. I'm gonna select Wii Video. I'm going to Create and Share. It'll take a moment to, lo to load. For you, once it's loaded, you're going to want to create a new project. So my project's already up and running, so I can find it right here. What I will do from here on out is to open that project. You can see that um, you'll need to create a new video, but mine's already up and running. So I'm going to edit. Once we video has fully loaded, what you're gonna be looking at is my dashboard. And let me take you through a few quick places of importance. You have a timeline option here. Right now I'm using the timeline simple. You have storyboard, simple, and advanced. I find simple for this project is what works best. You don't get um, kind of weighed down with all the tools that are available to you, but it's also more sophisticated than just the storyboard function. From there, you'll want to take a look at media, which is this folder with the me in it. The my media is where all of your media lives. Now I have a lot of media already because I've done this before. Um, but there's also some preloaded media available to you. There's preloaded videos, preloaded audio, transitions, graphics, and then your ability to add text. There's also themes available, and then publish is here when we're ready. But right now, what we'll plan to do is upload the media that you've selected. When you select upload, we're gonna import from the web, specifically Drive. And there you should find that folder that you created. I'm going to connect to Google Drive. I'm going to give File Picker access. My selections will open. I'm going to select that folder. Notice that it's at the very top. That's why I gave it the double zero title before the actual title, so it was I could easily find it. And then I'll select every single photo that I've already pre-selected. Now I'm going to X out of that because I've already uploaded all of this, all of those images. So I'm going to navigate back over to Timeline, back over to the Me folder, and you can see I'm going to scroll down and all of my most recent media that I've uploaded is located at the bottom of my media folder. Now to bring your media onto your timeline, you'll select and bring it down and place it exactly where you want it to be placed. Now again, I've already done this, and so I have my images exactly where I want them to be in the order that they are most applicable to the poem that I'll be reading. Now, full disclosure, I didn't write this poem, a former student of mine did, but the selection of images um, I did select to match his poem. And so now that I've selected my media, uploaded my media, placed the media in a specific order on my timeline, I'm ready to record my voice over. So here goes nothing.
Oh, and one thing, you'll want to make sure that you select allow. It's this tiny little button here next to the left green check mark. And I'll hit close. Oh, I actually, if you don't do this too quickly, you can hit remember as well. And hopefully you'll never see it again when you use WeVideo. So I'm ready to record. The blue collar has given way to the silver screen. Celebrities now raise our children. Technology takes over your houses. Music had more passion back then. Now the mainstream takes over our children. Their cell phones control their minds. Digital communication is all that exists. Does anyone actually talk anymore? Socialization is just a click away. No one goes outside. Our, our playgrounds are a wasteland. Artists who shine now lurk in the shadows. If it's shot high def, exploding in fake 3D, we don't care to see it. When was the last time you saw a painting, enjoyed live music, enjoyed the live world, really observed the world around you? It's difficult with your head down, ears plugged in, scrolling through your messages, sitting inside. All right, let's see how it, how it works. And I'm gonna hit save. Now, full disclosure, I probably would try that one more time. I fumbled through a few of the lines. I probably should have practiced reading it aloud a couple times before I recorded my voice but let's see what happens. And it looks as though, unfortunately, my recording started in the middle of the fifth image. And that's a bit of a bummer because I wanted it to begin here. So let's see what happens when I hit play. The blue collar has given way to the silver screen. Celebrities now raise our children. Technology takes over your houses. Music had more passion back then. Now the mainstream takes over our children. All right, I'm gonna pause. So in a nutshell, that's how it works. And it could have been better, and I know yours will be. So thanks for watching.